Hey, what's going on, y'all? Dak with another one, back with another one. Um, man, it's been wild, <laughs> even from last night into shit moment of recording. I didn't even watch my uh, replay of the stream. I'm watching the LBM Coliseum. I took a couple of shots, and Fittinelli's acting a damn fool on the panel. You already know. <laughs> Mr. Fittinelli wants attention from the LBM Coliseum. I tell you, this, this, nigga, this nigga is so emotional. He can't even realize that people don't fuck with him like that bro like bro 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 sit sit your ass down bro like you're you're not doing anything special okay Fentanelli, you you just need to sit down Fentanelli, Fentanelli, the mob boss of the bullshit that nigga that nigga's a clown man he's a whole ass clown but all he does is cry about the same old shit over and over again nobody wants to listen to that shit as soon as a nigga dies or whatever and who disappears this nigga wants to reappear and try to reinvent himself you're a clown bro you're a clown bro like i'm just looking at this shit right now then you got archer archer uh his uh t- tentacle ass on the panel act no damn fool but who is this fucking uh illegal what's his name Mr. Real Estate, he looks like a damn illegal. That's all I'm going to say about him, but he, he's weird. I'm, I'm going to cook him this coming up Thursday and things like that. But, man, these weirdos on the Internet, especially on panels like this. I mean, shouts out to Ramil, though. But, man, he got all these wild motherfuckers on him, man. You just got to look at what niggas be on. And that's the thing about me. I'm just not tripping off this whole thing. Like, niggas just need to just calm down. Like we we're not we're not tripping off of anything or schedule an event, you know. It's just what it is. Like niggas need to just just chill for a minute, you know. We're not tripping off of anything, and, and especially not tripping off of people that's insignificant. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, libertarianism, we're going to say three. We're going to say part three. And, you know, I'm going to schedule that on the 18th. Excuse me, my nose is acting up. Y'all better bear with me. Yeah, eight o'clock, eight no, eight fifteen is nice. I wish it was eight ten. Upload the image. Y'all know what it is. I know y'all hate this mic. Niggas was hating this mic a long before we cropped it. But you know, la la da ba da. The libertarianism. Okay, let me let me look at the word. Let me look at this word up. Libertarianism. Yeah, Sunday Madness. I was on the other stream deck. My assessments. Yeah, it's just you know things has been going on lately. Who they got up on here? They got some little niggas on here, man. Like who the fuck is these niggas? Like they they a bunch of boo boos on here, man. Like who are these boo boo fool ass niggas, man? Man, these niggas is just weird, bro. Did I say libertarianism. Yeah. Oh well, let me let me get that down. And yep, yeah, tuckled on. Acted a five, you know, but that that's just the thing with me. Yeah, done, and we just we're just here, you know. And I'm just like, okay, we we here, and then I'm just like, hey man, we we. <laughs> We we set the notion and we're gonna schedule another event. And it's just like I feel like DTN eight is is very necessary. 
And since we're going all in, this is there. And then I'll say another. Oh, I'm spelling another wrong. Another. Of daily Thursday news, and let's see what we got here on the nineteenth. We still in springtime, you know what I'm saying? We're still in springtime. The spring is rough, y'all. The spring May's May's tough for me. Especially the first, the last week. It's my birthday weekend, as so I'm chilling. We are here in the come around seat. Let, let, let me stop. He said, "Nobody knows the come around the come around the." He said, stop it, nigga. Stop singing like that. You're stressing us out. (laughs) Oh, my God. Next thing you know. Create an event. Yeah, your channels. It's dead and I don't 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 I was getting my merengue on. Let me let me <laughs> Niggas is niggas is stupid, bro. But yeah, you got Fit Nelly acting a damn fool on the panel, man. Like emotional as fuck, man. I'm I'm about to troll him in a in a couple more minutes, but uh not a couple more minutes, but you know, I just want him to talk his bullshit. Nobody nobody's done that fuck nigga, man. But, you know, I ain't going to troll. I'll probably troll him by the next hour or so because I know he's going to get emotional and amped up. And, you know, I'm going to do this little, like a little recording. And I'm just I'm just going to fuck with y'all a little bit because I know it's 10, what, 54, you know, got time. And I'm just like, <laughs> it's seven minutes into recording. I'm just talking my shit. But, you know, um, let me see. Let me see. Let me see something for a kid. And um, I want y'all to, I, 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 I could better yet and show you than I can tell you. Okay. Let me, let me get this little share. And I, I love the screen share on this. This is better than uh, StreamYard. So, right. It is right here. Okay. You see this mic? That's what I'm currently using. I'm on a hyper cardioid pickup pattern. Just to let you know, um, look, look at me right here. Look at me right here, giving it a fucking five star. It was a four point oh star, but now you look at me right now. Now you, now you see, uh, I'm, I'm on this comment right here. I said, excellent buy for the price. Highly recommended this, uh, this mic for starting out. <laughs> That's where I fucking wrote, man, man, and 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 shouts out to Mike Delgado, man. Like this is this mic has done me wonders. I've did it in testing, it sounded great, and I got it from this uh these people right here, Zen Pro Audio, and they thanked me, and they're from South Carolina. That's where I bought it from. I bought, bought it from up here, bought it from up here, and the reason I bought it, I don't know if you could see multiple. Um, I clicked on it. Okay, I bought it from Zen Pro Audio is i feel like this is one of the the things you get so let me stop screen sharing it and um get back to y'all you know it's just like let's show you right here this is what i'm using it's got all the pads the db pads and all that other stuff and then we got you know you get the microphone you get the stand and it's got its own thread and stand inside the shock mount. And then if you take the shock mount off, you get the another stand of threading. And you got to use something else with a threading with that. And then it comes with a case, black case, hard shell case. That's the cool thing about it. You can take it everywhere. Look, 
That's what it looks like. And I spent two hundred dollars on it. This last week, it was like a late birthday gift, and I wanted one so I can start pre-recording and show y'all. That's all it is, and it's got all the specs, connectivity, uh, variable. It's extremely biased condenser. Yeah, they said biased condenser, extremely biased operating principle, and it's got a sensitivity, of course, thirty-six dBV. And IPA and then the impedance is 200 and the max SPL is 134 decibels 1% and the self noise is 11 dBA that's the quietest you ever get anything over 13 is pretty much normal for a condenser it depends on the price this is quality right here for this price $200 and if you go upper tier it costs up in the thousands or whatever and high pass filter you got the high pass filter feature um they have all this stuff and includes the hard hard case, shock mount, hard mount. You get three things. You get the case, shock mount, all that. And that, call, like, that adds the $200. And the polar pads cost the extra money as well. So that's the description of it. The M179 CAD Equitech. That's what I'm using. And in case y'all was wondering on this pre-record, but you know what I'm saying? Like, that's the whole purpose yeah it's a condenser yeah i use these in my recordings and stuff like that but normally i don't use these a lot on the live stream so i, I was just a little mic flex little mic flex in case y'all was wondering what i'm using as my standard but that's that's the thing about this microphone like i love it you get in motion you be like all right you just need that little phantom power. And, you know, I got my little interface going and I'm just talking to y'all left and right, left and right. And that's the thing about it. You, you're in a situation, you're talking, you get in motion. And then you just look at it and be like, all right, this is this is it. And that's that's how you got to look at it. One thing one thing I can say about it in this recording in so many regards, most people, they just want to look at it and be like, all right, this thing over here acting crazy and tripping and, you know. And since it's almost 11 and things like that, I'll get this in and when I get this out. The reason I observe a lot of niggas and do the screenshots on the Daily uh, Thursday News Network, and it stems from uh, DeAndre's channel. Shouts out DeAndre and the Palace of Pay the Advisor himself. We was doing Dereliction News Network, and it was a brilliant idea, and I'm glad it was a concept. He was always wanting to talk about the history and the past of the 1.0 days. That's the idea. I always talk about it on vlog streams, but do it with screenshots, and he suggested And I came up with a brilliant name. I could have had the church feel. I could have had that. I said, no, no, no. We're going to call it a news segment. And I took the idea and put it on my channel. That's the reason why you didn't see a lot of thirsty thrills. I'll bring it back during the summer. And that's summer from all the way from winter in the spring. I don't know what the spring edition will be. It may be DTN. It's going to be a little different because it's going to be a lot of screenshots. I may bring that back next year. We'll see if they like this or not because they got the most views. And we know how many segments is a spring segment. So it's just a segment that we are. And then we'll have a finale. When the spring comes, we'll have a fucking finale. Oh, it's beautiful. And that's it. And that's just what you're going to see. That's what you're going to see. And you you know you know what this is. And then most people, they're just going to be like, okay, we're here. And... I think one thing I can say about this in this recording I'm recording is you notice most people going to do what they're going to do regardless of the situation and you see what you get. And that's, that's the thing. That's the thing. So I'm going to try this real quick. And you just got to have what you have in so many words and that's that's not something i expect and you notice this is the type of stuff that you're going to hear right you know but when you hear this stuff 
it's one of those things you'd be like, what do you expect? You know, and that's the thing that you have to have it on. And then mainly you just want people just understanding your situation. So, yeah. But, you know, yeah, I had to turn that little filter on. And it, it's one of those things that you got to be mindful of. And that's just that's just how most people will look at it and be like, OK, I'm here and we're explaining ourselves. And I'm out here talking about it and just like say, hey, you know, we out here and we're just doing it. We're doing the damn thing. But the thing about me is like, you know, looking at gear and stuff and looking at what's compatible to this computer. I mean, Chrome has come a long way. Heard about the Chrome Flex, heard about a lot of stuff. I was like, man, these mixers, man, it's wild. But, you know, but I'm over here just chilling and, you know, about to head out later or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, but, you know, it's supposed to rain today because I don't know when. It's probably 12 p.m. or whatever. You know, it's a nice feel. And I think the rest of the week is going to be warmer. And you got that, right? And that's that's what you're getting in GA. You just practice it and you just teach it the whole time. So I hope this helps and I hope people enjoy their day. And, you know, that's all I'm going to talk about today. I'm just talking about, you know, just flex you a little bit what I'm talking about on the microphone and it's just random, but, you know, just watching the LBM Coliseum, everybody's being a bunch of niggas on there right now. You know, I'm about to troll the old boy and, and, and this illegal. I'm like, man, he, he's camming up like saying, he said, man, fuck all y'all niggas. Y'all niggas ain't talking about nothing. He must have paid Ramil a large sum. And I'm just like saying. And I'm just saying, man, I'm about to troll fit Nelly for me. <laughs> Y'all, y'all have to please forgive me because this nigga's a clown, man. I know he's going to get emotional like a little bitch like he always do. This nigga cannot stand me, bro. That George Floyd shit will fuck his ass up. And he going to get off the panel when I start trolling. But you know how it is. So with that, y'all may have a blessed day. Peace and shalom. And I'm out.